Hello, this is Kevin Patton for Gallagher Fluid Seals. Today's video is part two of our video series on rotary seals. This video will cover elastomeric rotary lip seals, bonded oil seals, Parker clipper oil seals, and Garlock closure oil seals. There are three specific types of elastomeric lip seals that we will review. Oil seals, also known as elastomeric lip seals, are a catch-all name for seals widely used in rotary sealing applications. See figure one and figure two on the right as a reference. Additionally, the Parker Clipper oil seal and Garlock closure seal will be reviewed in detail in this video. These two product lines offer higher sealing performance where it is required as a result of additional design features. See figure three and figure four on the right. So let's start with bonded oil seals. Traditional oil seals are the most common type of rotary sealing product. This product has some key features that can be utilized depending on the performance needed. In our next video, we will discuss materials, but we will touch base briefly here. The oil seal can have an outer diameter material composed of an exposed metal or molded elastomer over the can. Examples of both are on the right. On bonded oil seals, a garter spring can be utilized to provide additional force on the sealing lip, allowing it to seal at slightly higher pressures. Additionally, an exclusionary lip can be used in combination to the primary sealing lip facing the opposite direction, which provides protection against system contaminants. These features can be mixed and matched to provide a seal that matches an application need. So what are the common oil seal applications? Along with seals that retain oil, grease, and other viscous fluids, GFS offers seal designs to accommodate high eccentricity, separation of two fluids, dry running, high pressure, and wiping and scraping. In addition, there are oil seal designs that exclude contaminants, such as light, dust, water splash, gravel, and mud. These oil seals can be found in gearboxes, reducers, pumps, motors, automotive applications, appliances, and custom equipment. Chapter three of this video series will highlight seal material considerations as mentioned before. Topics discussed in chapter one of this rotary sealing video series are relevant to bonded oil seals via shaft finish and tolerance, housing, and bore considerations. Next, we are going to discuss Parker Clipper oil seals. These seals are known worldwide for their ability to provide superior performance in the most demanding and critical applications. A one-piece molded construction and the ability to provide application-specific designs, if needed, are just a few of the reasons clipper seals are specified for critical applications. Clipper seals are available for shaft diameters from 0.250 inches, 6.35 millimeters, to over 65 inches, or 1,651 millimeters in both standard and high-performance elastomer compounds. With over 10,000 tooled sizes, clipper seals are readily available for most applications in either a solid or split design. A number of different clipper seal profile designs exist for a wide variety of specific applications. Consult the Gallagher Seals website for a large offering of in-stock Parker clipper seals available to ship same day. So what are Parker Clipper oil seals commonly made from? The most unique feature of the Clipper oil seal is non-metallic construction. The metal case that is common with traditional lip seals is replaced with an aramid fiber and elastomer composite material. In worn housings, the composite outer surface can assist in preventing leak paths that would exist in a press fit metal can installation. When replacing seals in used equipment, an investment in a clipper seal can prevent a lot of unwanted maintenance down the road. A wide range of lip profiles are available with the Aramid Composite OD to suit virtually any application need. Stainless steel springs are standard on all clipper oil seals where the industry standard is a lower quality carbon steel. Clipper's spring material provides improved lip loading at higher temperatures and resists the rust and corrosion that is common with lower quality materials. The upgraded spring ensures consistent lip loading over the life of the seal. If a clipper seal is only offered from the factory in a solid design, Gallagher can split the seal and supply to the customer. So now let's talk about the common application examples for clipper oil seals. 
They are used in a wide range of industries, including light industrial, mining, paper, steel, food processing, marine, aerospace, and petrochemical. They can be found in a variety of locations or equipment, such as pumps, motors, gearboxes, crushers, rollers, mixers, compressors, drag lines, hoists, tapered bearings, and more. Clipper oil seals can be used as a direct replacement for metal case seals and provides the following benefits. A composite outer diameter provides a gasket type seal at the outer diameter for improved sealing in worn housings. Compression plates are not required for seal retention or lip loading. The tight press fit eliminates the need for a cover plate. They will not rust or corrode. Parker Clipper oil seals consist of a seal lip and a seal outer diameter to form a one-piece molded construction across the entire size range and a more robust design compared to gluing or crimping the seal lip to a metal case. They resist problems caused by thermal expansion when the seal case and housing are different materials. Parker Clipper oil seals are known for user-friendly installation and can help eliminate seal damage during installation. Next, we are going to discuss garlock closure seals. Garlock closure seals are offered in the following configurations. Single lip seals. These are ideal for most sealing applications, and they are general purpose seals available in a wide range of stock sizes. Split closure oil seals. These are designed for easy installation on large shafts without costly equipment teardown for seal replacement. Dual lip oil seals are recommended for applications requiring the protection from ingress and egress of material, the exclusion of abrasive or foreign materials, and difficult or unusual sealing challenges. And lastly, special purpose oil seals. These are recommended for high speed applications, reciprocating service, spherical bearings, tapered roller bearings, and or high pressure applications. Closure technology provides the answer for difficult operating conditions. Garlock's closure universal oil seals are manufactured without a metal case. They are intended for applications where the use of metal cased shaft seals is not possible. All of these models are available in either split or solid endless versions. They are, by virtue of their simple design, universally suitable for various applications and have proved their reliability in all sectors of industry. Now we are going to talk about the various configurations of closure oil seals from Garlock. Closure oil seals are available in a wide variety of configurations to meet the requirements of major industries. Millwright materials are used on all elastomeric seals for superior bearing protection. Millwright elastomers provide longer service life than their predecessors. Each of the new Millwright elastomers has been especially engineered to provide the highest abrasion resistance lowest wear, and exceptional chemical and temperature resistance. Closure oil seals are available in more than 50 different styles, in sizes from quarter inch to over 90 inches, solid or split, metal cased, or all rubber. They have had a strong brand presence in the United States since the 1920s. Today, they are also manufactured and branded in China and Germany. So, what are the typical applications for closure oil seals? They are mostly found in pulp and paper, aluminum, steel, and heavy industrial applications. Here are some of the most common equipment they are found in. Gear pumps, rolling mills, compressors, marine motors, earth movers, gear systems, blowers, mining machinery, and as wipers in hydraulic applications. So let's discuss the features and benefits of Garlock closure oil seals. Each oil seal has been specifically engineered to have the highest abrasion resistance and lowest wear of any seal in the industry, as we mentioned before. This translates directly to higher equipment efficiencies, longer bearing life, increased production, and less maintenance. Millwright materials contain breakthrough abrasion and wear properties for extended service life, improved chemical resistance, and a low coefficient of friction for less heat generation and lower power consumption. Thanks for watching part two of our rotary sealing video series on bonded oil seals. All types of oil seals mentioned in this video can be purchased from Gallagher Seals on our website, www.gallagherseals.com. Coming out shortly will be our next video webinar series, 
where we will discuss the common material types found in oil seals. Thanks again.